How's it going, my slow bros and ho-ho's? I hope you're all doing well. Today, we're going to open up a Celebration Special Collection Pikachu V Union box. This box contains a special four-part Pikachu card featuring Pikachu artwork from across 25 years. This box also contains a jumbo version of the card, four Celebrations booster packs, two regular booster packs, and a special version of Professor Burnett featuring the 25 logo. Now here are all four pieces of Pikachu V Union in its glory. Now these cards feature 25 different Pikachus from across 25 years. And how you're going to play these cards is by getting them into your discard pile and then placing all four at the same time onto your bench. Now Professor Burnett's gonna help us get this done cause she's gonna allow us to search our deck for up to two cards and to place those cards into our discard pile. Afterwards, we're gonna shuffle our deck. Now remember, the only way to get Professor Burnett featuring the 25 logo is from this box. Now let's take a look at the jumbo card version of all four cards. And I prefer the jumbo version of this card as opposed to the four separate versions as everything fits beautifully together. Here's our two regular booster packs, one Darkness of Blaze and the other is Battle Styles. And here's our four packs of Celebrations. All right, let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start our first pack off with a Zekrom, a Palkia. Ooh, we have a Cleffa from the Classic Collection, and a Lunala. Here's the code card for the pack. Now, Neo Genesis was the first set to introduce Gold and Silver Era Pokemon. Uh, it released in Japan in February of 2000 and in the US in December of 2000. Now, a lot of people were hoping that the Lugia from Neo Genesis would get reprinted, but I'm actually kind of glad that they chose a baby Pokemon per se, because Gold and Silver was the first generation to introduce breeding, day and night mechanics, uh, evolution mechanics based on how often you use that Pokemon and its relationship with you. So picking a Pokemon that represented these newer mechanics that make Pokemon what it is today, I think was an excellent choice. So we're gonna go ahead and open up our Darkness of Blaze pack next. Then we're gonna open up two celebration packs, our battle styles pack, and then our last celebrations pack. And they place the co-card upside down. If you're able to redeem this code, please let me know and actually let me know what kind of pulls you got. You can let me know in the comments down below. All right, we start off with the Lightning Energy, a Vanillish, Rose, Corvus Squire, Shelmet, Nicket, Hot Topic, Cabbage Patch Doll, Vanillite. Oh, sorry about that. We have a Bunnelby. We have Carnivine, aka Audrey from Little Shop Horrors, and a Galarian Darmanitan. Again, we're starting off with Zekrom. We have Dialga, Cosmoem, and Professor's Research, who's thinking outside the box. At least it's not Zekrom, but we have its counterpart, Reshiram. We have Lugia, a Dark Gyarados, which is a reprint from Team Rocket, and a Surfing Pikachu V. Now, Team Rocket was the first set to introduce Dark Pokemon. It was this concept that Team Rocket had turned Pokemon evil to use them to do their evil bidding. Um, Team Rocket was released in Japan in November of 1997, and it was released in the U.S. in April of 2000. 
which is quite a big gap in time between releasing the set in Japan and the US. But we would see Dark Pokemon again in Neo Destiny alongside with Light Pokemon. And while I'm on the subject about Team Rocket and Neo Destiny, there's a card in Neo Destiny that's based on the Goldenrod City Radio Tower. Um, in Gold and Silver, this radio tower was used by Team Rocket to broadcast signals that would turn Pokemon evil. So I, I think it's quite fitting that they had light and dark Pokemon in Neo Destiny. All right, we're going to start off with a fighting energy. We have a camping gear. Next, we have single strike energy, a Cedra, Timber, Galarian Slowpoke. We have a Corfish, a Plato Salandit, one eyed Roly Coley. Your urn of vitality is our reverse, and a Hollow Cherum, which you can barely tell the hollow foils there. Sorry about the glare. Right. Let's get into our last celebrations pack. All right. We're going to start this pack off with Dialga, Kyogre, Xerneas, and a full art Pikachu. All right, that's it for today. Um, if you liked or didn't like this video, please let me know down in the comments below. If you're not subscribed, please consider doing so, and I will catch you all later.